Hello, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. And I am so excited to share something with you today that I have created. I have been asked to join a design team. Um, it's a Facebook group called Inspired to Create. Um, the girl's name is Donna Davis Bell and she does um, digitals, some beautiful Victorian shabby chic gorgeous digitals. So this is her um, Facebook group Inspired to Create and I'm going to put her link in the description below. But I'm going to show you what I made with some of the digitals that I downloaded from her. Um, this is just a little flip book made out of envelopes and I, I just kind of clipped a little uh, flower that I made on here. And let's see, we have, I've got it closed with a uh, sorry silk ribbon because I do love, love, love sorry silk. So I made it out of pink envelopes. It's got a little dangle thing hanging here. And this is one of her um, digital prints that I just printed and I raised it up a little bit. I put some lace behind it and a, a beautiful bling flower with a cameo down inside of it. So it flips up like this. And this is one of her beautiful prints, the teacup. And I just went around the edges with some stickles. Um, on this side, I've got one of her teapots pouring out and just some beautiful, beautiful prints. So let's see, let's start here. This one, I've got this little uh, paper clip here just for a little bling, but this one opens this way. And I've got a page here that um, I've just kind of tipped in, this little page. And I'm using avocado dyed papers because avocado dyed paper has a pale pink um, color to it. So that's what I'm using so it would match this. And then in this side, I've got a pocket, and that's one of her beautiful digitals. So I've got a pocket with a little um, tag in there, holding that one in. Then over here, I just took one of the little teapots that comes in the kit, and this is also a little piece that came in her kit. So all of that just goes there like that. And then this one opens again. So that's kind of why I had my little paper clip right here just kind of holding all that together. So this opens again, and up here I've done some collaging with um, just some paper. I've got a pocket right here that would hold a big tag if I want to put that in there. I made a pocket here, and then I took one of her prints, and I made this little miniature journal, and it's got my avocado dyed papers inside. So, and that... Oh, this one, I didn't show you this. This one folds out like that. So it's got these pages in it that close, but on the right side, two of them fold out. And so that just goes down in that little pocket. And then this, all of these are her prints. Now, these are just cutouts. I made a belly band and put this little um, teapot thing that opens up like that for journaling on front and back. And that goes in the belly band. I've got some little stickles here. And then the belly band, I mean, this area opens here and here. Oh, my gosh. Do you love these prints, guys? Look at this. Look at this. The dance, the bell of the ball. I mean, they're absolutely stunning. This one says, he loves me, he loves me not. He loves me, he loves me not. Isn't that precious? And then I put a pocket back here, and we've got this beautiful lady here that I just did some fancy edging on the corners. So all of this, I just, I love this kind of stuff. Oh my goodness, love it. All of that just closes back up like that. Now, so I'm going to close this one so I can show you this side. On this side, I made, this is my little dangle, um, my little beaded dangle hanging here. And I just put a little tab and that's to kind of keep this door shut. So this is a beautiful print and it just kind of pokes up under the edge of that tab just to keep it from flying everywhere. And this one opens this way. Don't you love flip books? They're so much fun. Over here, I've got one of her teacups. This is another one of her little journaling card cutouts. I put a tag up inside here um, and I had to put a pull tab on it so I didn't lose it up in there. And then I've got journaling papers inside here. These three flip up. 
and then these two you can just write on those and then this is one of the printouts that comes with this kit um, this kit is called Isabella I forgot to tell you that Isabel or Isabella um, and it's all Paris and teacups and teapots and just some beautiful floral images over here I took one of the images and I cut it into a triangle and I created oh this is one of her pieces too that you can cut out I created a little corner tuck and in that corner tuck I just stuck this little it's just a little piece of a book um, rules of etiquette long long time ago beautiful little book and then this is a um, it's like glassine, but it's really not. It's tracing paper. I made this little envelope, and I put a little fake stamp in the corner. And then inside of it, I put one of the teacups that comes in this um, digital kit. So it's stuck in there. And then in the pocket, I've got another little miniature journal that I put in there with my avocado dyed papers. This is the beautiful printout beautiful beautiful vintage Victorian lady and one of the tags that comes with the printout three of these um, come with this digital kit so I just stuck that tag I probably need to put a little lace or something on that little piece right there so then this guy closes back and just tucks up under there but we're not done yet this one also flips down how fun I just love flips and pockets and tags and things that turn and swirl and oh it's just so much fun so here I've got a little corner tuck spot all of this is part of the digital kit another tag a little airmail from France a little journaling card thing right there I put some stickles around that bow and just this beautiful script on the back she does such a good job with her um, digitals now in here I took one of the tags and I just made a tuck spot so I could stick something else down in there if I want to over here she's created a little journaling spot that's all part of it I hope you can see this it looks like the glare is so bad and then I put a large tag over here in this pocket with journaling spots on the back and then I put this little bling button kind of thing that I made and I'm just kind of tucking that edge up under there so it just kind of sits right there I thought that was cute and then over here you can pull this guy out and there's another giant journaling card that I put a little pull tab on there to be able to do that so that's that page this is this page this is this page isn't that cute? Don't you just love it? I just love the way it all came out. And on the back, I did something totally different. And honestly, I'm not sure if I like it or not. I may cover the whole thing. But I took some of the cutouts that she had in the kit, love the little horse and carriage, and I put, I put them down and I outlined them with some Stabilo pencil. And then I put a dryer sheet over it. So that's what this is. This is a dryer sheet. And then I stamped. I just did rubber stamping all over that. So anyway, that is my kit. And like I said, um, it's just a cute little flip book that I've made. And I will have the link below for all the digital prints. So you can go and check out her channel, Inspired to Create. She has a YouTube channel and a Facebook group, and I'll put all those links below for you. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a blessed day. Bye-bye.